arms there, but he does have a head. <laughs> oh, oh God, she's gone. She's left us. She's gone. All right. Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Little Nightmares in First Person. Today, we're doing something I've been dreading, and that is the hospital. Oh, God, there's something weird going on. Oh, okay. We're going to have to do this in uh, in third person for a second. Just because I was told that there is a bit of a glitch here when it comes to the first person camera. Because this is just a fan mod, after all. So once we're through the beds, then we're good. But the reason I'm kind of dreading this is the way the controls are. So when you turn the camera in first person, it um, it takes a while. Oh, and well, that, that doesn't help anything now, does it? I thought there was people in these beds. You can't see when you're in a, you're in third person. You can kind of see something. Oh, that's interesting. Whoa, oh, I'm glad I could see that. Yeah, the reason why I'm scared of this is if we go in first person for a second, like this is how quickly I can turn, right? Oh, oh, oh God. Oh, you had some weird eyes there, Six. That was interesting. The reason why I'm not looking forward to it. Sorry, I can't even finish my sentences when I'm playing this game. It's just so stressful. Um, is because the turning of the torch is going to be really hard. So I don't know how much I'm going to be able to do it in first person. Especially later on. Like the final scene with the mannequins is just so crazy. Oh, yeah, the elevator. Oh, 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 here we go. Boink. Your turn. Boink. Come on, then. Let's take it up. We're not going to die, are we? Um, can I go, please? Thank you. Can we see it fall? Yeah. Bye-bye. Oh, it doesn't even fall that far. <laughs> it was all a lie. I'm looking forward to this, though. Um, this in, oh, here it comes. This to me, however, is, um, is one of those, um, oh, you see what I mean? Like the way I shine my torch isn't based on where I look the camera. It's kind of based on, on, um, on my left stick, which is how I move. Cause you wouldn't have a right stick isn't a camera in Little Nightmares. So when I turn backwards like that, I'm actually not looking at it. Well, I'm looking that way. Ooh, what is, what is that? Is that some sort of oxygen machine? What does the law say? Oh, I don't know. I don't think there's anything in here. There might have, I think there's definitely one of these kids. Um, there's one of the glitch kids, but I've got all of them. So I think I can just go straight ahead. It's definitely down one of... Um, oh, there's a blood splatter. <laughs> it so feels like a Resident Evil thing or something. When I click... When I click right bumper... Okay, so we're first person here, guys. Okay, brilliant. Oh, because I can't look up. I can't look up. Oh, I can kind of, maybe? Oh, this is going to be tricky, man. This is going to be so tricky. <laughs> oh, sody pops. Num nums. More sody pops. Oh, the sody pops. Give me another one. Yes. Get to choose any one I like go with this one. Look, we have a ticket system as well here. Interesting. Interesting. So at one point, it, look, it's like all of these places were normal until like not too long ago. And then something happened. Now I've got a theory actually as to, um, can I switch? Oh my God. Are you serious? I'm going to have to do it this way. Oh no. Oh wow. I'm actually doing it. That's, that's quite impressive. <laughs> No way. Oh, I'm so good. There it is. Yay, I'm in. <laughs> oh, but where are we? Are we actually in the hospital? Still, we must be. And that hallway is still above us. That is so strange. So I didn't I didn't mention it in my theory video, but um, I mean, it's pretty obvious that Six is the one kind of saving him from, from this. And that could be another reason why she's like sick of him in a way. <laughs> she's the one always saving him. Yes. Look, she's actually st like she's getting away from me because she realizes that there's something not right with me. <laughs> Whether or not Six can actually sense um, what I can see or what what I can hear, as in the um, as in the TV static, I'm really not too sure. Um, so we seem to have a toilet, some beds, uh, hanging beds, 
And the hallway there. Also, another propaganda of the signal tower. That's like, I'm starting to slowly build together another theory. Um, that for people who, I, I love my story video because I, I, I mean, I like to build like a, a coherent story that has like feeling and emotion in it. But a lot of the times, if you're just like, no, this doesn't make sense because of this, a lot of people won't be like, oh, that doesn't make sense. <laughs> oh, look, we got loads of kid drawings here. So we've got the hypnosis, which could be the static, but it's also, it could be referring to the, um, did Six just pick something up? <laughs> oh, hello. Can I take that? No, I'm not allowed it. Okay. <laughs> uh, that could be referring to the electric chair. You've got two pictures of the doctor. You've actually got two pictures up there of the uh, thin man. You've got a picture of the TV. Uh, you've got pictures of the people being taken. And the top right up there is actually one of the other kids from the... Um, the, not the it's not the comic books, but it's kind of the online web book things there's actually a picture in the last video that looked like a ghost is the sh the kid in the sheets and this could be referring to the because it was the bullies had drawn this um, it could be referring to the empty-headed kids because it looks like they're smaller look at that there it is there is the thin man right there so kids know of him uh you've also got a moth uh huh i have no idea what that refers to a moth right so let's continue Let's get you. Oh, we got the a gnome as well. So, and again, like I've said, is it this one? I don't think it is this one, is it? I think it's, I think it's this guy. Yeah, it's the bunny one. The bunny one has it. Yeah, there it is. I hear the key. I wonder if I can put my head inside it and I'd be like, is the key actually there? That's it. <gasps> what does it look like if we're first person? First person x-ray. Oh, that'd be interesting. Six, do you want to go? Do you want to go in? And I'll have a look at you. Where are you? Oh, she's already there. Okay, she doesn't go X-ray-ish. What? <laughs> so you can actually see. Oh, what is that mechanism in there? I always saw that. I was like, huh? You're gonna go in? You don't want to do it? What does it look like the other way? <gasps> Reverse X-ray. Okay, fine. Whatever. <laughs> Spoil my fun. Fine. I'd want to do it anyway. So I think I've got the I've got the achievement for this one, which is um, burn all of the teddy bears. I think I think that's what it is. Look at this elevator. It waits for six. It knows. And this is just a cool little thing to see. Um, look, there you go. Untextured wall. That's interesting. <laughs> I noticed that when I was editing my other video when we were in the elevator, there was some wall that wasn't textured at all, and there it was. But I guess there's no need for for them to do it. Oh, <gasps> Ooh, that's going to be so cool when it comes to, like, burning the doctor alive. Oh, it always looked so much bigger when we got inside. No. Okay, I guess not. Do we get to see? Oh. Oh, yep. Yeah. Yep, there it is. Six, you look lovely there. And... Oh, there they go. <laughs> Once it loaded. They disappeared. I mean, all this stuff you're not supposed to see anyway. Can I get you inside there? Is that possible? <laughs> we are mono. Just remember to ditch six at the end. Now, I don't know whether it's um, it's because I've done this before or whether it's because it's just in the game. But I always feel that this part kind of drags. It is, however, the only part in the game that is like it. And it's very similar to the the ladies DLC, the residence. Um, because in that, or in there, there's there's a section like this where you have to there's like a main hub, a main room, and then you need to um, you need to go backwards and forwards, like left to right, to unlock one door in the middle or something like that. Uh, and this feels kind of similar. And I think it's the only bit in the nightmares that feels a bit slow because you're kind of like backtracking a lot. Oh god, this is gonna be interesting, isn't it? Oh dear. <laughs> oh dear. Let's see the hand. Yeah, there he goes. Just go, just go, just go, just go, just go. I don't know where he, where he doesn't he doesn't attack us here. It's kinda of like I'm gonna have to play without seeing. Come on then. Come on then. What are you gonna do? I'm gonna run this way. <laughs> Hurry up! Right, right, okay. I feel like, is he going to run under? Yeah, he's going to run. Okay, so once he, uh, once he runs this way, uh, we'll, we'll just go, ah! I think. 
I think now. Oh my god, he got me! Whoa! <laughs> he must have like... Wait, where am I? Oh, here, okay. So I've just got to go straight away. Look at him hiding under. <laughs> Look at him hiding under. I can't believe that. I can't believe he got me. Whoop. No, you don't. No, you don't. Ooh. Okay, here we go, here we go, here we go. Oh, okay, because he climbs. He freaking climbs. I know he does. Oh, he's already climbing! He's already climbing! Oh, God! Oh, God, just go! I'm not gonna turn around. I'm not gonna turn around. Just go! There we go. We're safe. We're safe for now. We're safe. Hip! Hip! Right, we just gotta run. We just gotta run. I don't think he comes at us for a while. He falls out somewhere here by that bench. He falls out there. Like, right in front of us. I think he's to the right here. He falls. Yeah, there he is. There he is. Oh, 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 oh. oh dear. I don't like it. <laughs> There's the door I came through. Go away, you. Now it's my turn. Right, where is he going to go? Uh-huh. There he is. <sighs> Can do it again? Yeah! Squishy. Okay, I think he comes from the left. You come from the left. Oh! Oh! <laughs> Yo! Oh, look at his little fingies. Oh, disappeared. Oh! Oh! <laughs> yeah! There we go. And if you want a secret achievement, you hit him again. Just to make sure he's dead. There is actually a glitch in this where you can skip a lot of this um, by summoning, like, the second fuse. Um... I don't know how you do that, but I don't know. I think, I feel like we should probably just, you know, go ahead and just see what it's like in first person. Because I know that if you're watching this, you probably already, you probably know what's coming. And you've probably already seen it. <gasps> oh, are we actually going to see what six does to these fingers? Does she actually break them? Right, that's fine. She's just bending them. That one. Okay. Hey. Hi! <laughs> that one just sort of bent a bit out of shape. We can't lie. I just gotta keep going. This this isn't the bit I'm dreading. I can't remember where it is, but it's after. It's I think it's once we go through this elevator. That's the bit I'm dreading. I'm dreading this bit. Yo! Hello! So here we go. Let me get this fuse. Put the fuse in there. Um, I also feel like we kind of in the, the school is just so perfect because we're made very aware of um, of the teacher quite early on, and in this one uh, we don't see the doctor for a long time, um, and I feel like that's that's actually to the detriment of um, of this section because you kind of want to see at least a little bit to start with, be like, oh, what's that? Because they did that perfect with the uh, the teacher. Okay, so we're gonna... Oh, no, man. This is gonna be horrendous. This is gonna be so horrendous. Like, this is the thing, like... Oh, no. I hope I can do this in third person. Okay, he's gonna come. He's gonna come. He's gonna come. No, don't look at him. Don't look... Turn! Ooh. Okay, you need to, we need to be like... There we go, there we go, there we go. Okay, he's close now. Oh, no, it's impossible. It's impossible because I can't turn the camera. I can't, like, move the camera. <laughs> yeah, I can't do it. Oh, no. Oh, I so wish you could. Oh, no. Okay, so we're going to have to, like, go in and out of first person here. Just because normally when you have a light, like, you turn... But then, when you hold the right stick, that's how uh, Mono aims. But having first person completely negates that. <laughs> you gonna come? Are you gonna come? Come on! Come on, cutie! There you go. Like, so, yeah, there you go. So, when you move around, you can aim it towards him. So, I w I'm not able to do that. I like the, the, that, that, that bit scripted, though. That bit scripted. Because there's nothing to do here. Okay. Let's have a look at these guys. So again, like... Uh, it, it's... It's very... It's not made clear. 
why these mannequins are afraid of the light. How they even got here. How they lost their limbs. Like, their bodies are all there, but their limbs aren't. And if they're, if they're victims of the television, then why do they just, you know, the faces are gone. That's what the television does, but it doesn't do anything else. Hmm. Oh god, yeah, here we go. Yeah, we're gonna need it for this bit though. Because <laughs> whenever there's a mannequin, unfortunately, I can't do it because I can't aim. I can only look at where I'm going. Yeah, so there's, there's one. And then, yeah, this bit would be nigh on impossible to do. <laughs> I go first person for a second. Oh god, oh god. I was gonna say, can they, can they grab me from under here? Yeah, there's no way, man. There's no way. Because <laughs> as soon as I turn around, that's it. I'm done. And I can't look up at them. And I think looking up at them is kind of what you need to do. Because if you look at their feet, then it doesn't really work. Yeah, yeah. There we go. There we go. There we go. Okay, here we go. Here we go. No. 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 I wanted to just see that for a second. <laughs> <laughs> Look at you! You're so creepy! Go jump up here! Jump up here! Jump up the grate! Get to the cheese! Cheese, grommet! <laughs> Where's the cheese? So this is, if you haven't seen this, this is a secret achievement. You grab the cheese. Because I was always wondering, like, what the cheese has to mean something. Oh, there, there's, the, there's the things. There's the horrors. Oh, look, they're already ready. Hello. <laughs> Hello. So we go through here. Da, da, da. And then you go through into this one. And then you drop the cheese down the hole. And then it eats it. <laughs> So whoever was in this cell, uh, obviously had their, their wits about them enough to write all of the days that they were stuck in here, which is quite interesting. Okay. Um, I would say that we can do the first bit. We can definitely do the arms, but then as soon as we get past the arms, we're not going to be able to do it because then we need to shine the light. So let's give, let's give that a go, shall we? Let's just try and <laughs> try and do it. <laughs> You try and run. Oh! oh god. Overcompensation. Oh no! Okay, here we go. Now I'm gonna have to switch. Yeah, okay. That was kind of scary. <laughs> that was kind of terrifying. It's gonna be one. Yep. It's not so bad. It's not so bad. It's a nice place, so shut up in your face. <laughs> yes, you. I see you. I see you. Oh, God. I got an airplane. Catch it. Oh, no, what the fuck are you? <laughs> oh, that was weird. There's an airplane going overhead, and then the rumbling of the base of this was like, oh, oh, oh. And there we go. I was going to say, they can't climb, can they? Oh, look at them. So cute. Beautiful. And now we can go through here. Yeah. <laughs> Sweet. Right, do we need to actually turn on the light? I don't think we do. We don't need to turn the light at all. Um, because I think I know where the button is. Unless the unless it you need power. No, you don't. You don't even need power here. Okay, here we go. Because he'll just get up now, won't he? He should do. Go on. Do it. Yeah, there it is. <laughs> However, I cannot do this in first person because as soon as I start walking backwards, he's going to come at me. Whoop! He didn't block the thing, did he? Oh, good. Oh, good. There we go. There we go. See you later, pal. See you later. Oh, is this the really hard bit? This is the bit. I'm, well, I can't do this in first person. I would love to give it a shot, but I'm <laughs> just going to... I can tell you what's going to happen. I'm going to be grabbed straight away. So we'll not waste our time, will we? <laughs> yeah, look. at This is the tricky one. Oh, there's the guy with the teeth as well. Oh, look at all these limbs. Hold on, let me fall down. Yeah. God, there's so many. So many. Like, can I actually go back that way? I think I can. I didn't realize that you could actually go all the way back. I was always sticking to the front bit. Hold on, I want to see that guy with the teeth again. Oh, 
God, that's terrifying. Okay, I think maybe this is the bit that I was definitely dreading. But, uh, yeah, we can't do this. Oh, I wish we could. Maybe, you know, when the mods get better. Maybe when we get better mods, we can, uh, we can do cool stuff. Like this in first person at the moment. Oh, God! Oh, he's got a belly on him. They've got, ooh, they've got shirts off. That's weird. Oh, ho, ho, ho! No, you don't! No, you don't! Okay, there we go. We've done it. 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 Woo! See you later! So what does that look like in first person? Now that we can probably go back into first person. There's just arms. Oh, look, there's six. What is six doing? Ooh, okay, she's just there. I was, I was cur kind of curious. I was like, ooh, can we see her doing something weird? <gasps> something we haven't seen before? Not quite. Oh, God. I always fail that the first time. I don't know what it is with that one. But, uh, yeah. Ooh, can we electrocute ourselves? Oh. <laughs> I thought it'd be time. The question is, why would there be an electric chair in a hospital? You know, a hospital's supposed to heal people. But why would it be here? Unless it's like deliberate euthanasia of things. I wonder if you could throw the ball in there. And what she would have... Can you throw the ball at them? Is that like a secret achievement? Take the ball! Oh, a dead medicine ball! Oh, he threw it! <laughs> nice! I just got an achievement. I was hoping to get at least one achievement. There you go! Sweet! I was wondering, why would there be a ball there? Did you see that six? He caught it like a boss! <laughs> Go on, you get the other one, six. Get the other fuse. Okay, I think that's the end of the mannequins. That's the end of the mannequins. But now it's the start of the doctor. It's gonna be interesting. It's definitely gonna be interesting seeing him in first person. <laughs> Come on! Do, 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 do. Look at you gliding. There you go. Plop it in, dear. Oop. Okay, and we're gonna not kill the doctor this time. Because you don't have to kill him. Oh, hold on, I need to change the uh, sentence here just a little bit. There we go. Now we won't have any blood. Yeah! Now we get super close to things. Whoa! <laughs> Everything's gone! Loading the next bit. Look at that. I wonder why they picked a yellow raincoat. We've already got a few characters with the yellow raincoats. They're like, no, it must be iconic. Give it a pointy head. Here we go. <laughs> it's a bit like Resident Evil, isn't it? It's a bit terrifying. I, I'm, I'm like, how does Mono do it? That's the question. It's, you know, any normal person would probably probably not do this <laughs> but that it's just he needs to get to those tvs just so badly okay this it'll be interesting seeing oh no that's right we're not there yet we're not at the masks we're at the um we're at the little hands first i think yeah the masks are through there yeah you can kind of see them can i just like bam <laughs> just break it before this happens right where does the other hand come from Oh, I think I see it. I see him. He's just hiding behind there. Look at him. There he is. Hello. Yum. Now, that's not a mannequin hand. That's, that's like, you see the bone of this. This is, an, this is a normal hand. Which means that the mannequins aren't really kept alive due to anything in particular. Oh, God. Oh god, yeah, there's too many. <laughs> Alright, we need to get in the corner here. Because they're both gonna come for us. Here we go. Yes! Both jump! Yeah! Yeah! Double kill! So, yeah, basically, it would appear that the hands, because they're part human, still have, like, a will of their own. Um, so the mannequins are themselves only come to life because of the human part of them, which is the torsos. So it's like they can they can take their body parts, they can take their arms and legs, but as long as something's still there, then they can sort of be 
Um, they, they can sort of still be alive. It's like their souls are still trapped in the body parts. Oh, wow. So, yeah. Some people have said that if this is a prequel, right? Which it is. That face up there is the janitor's head. And then that one definitely looks like a guest face. I don't know about these other ones. I feel like I've seen that one before. I don't know where I've seen that one. Uh, that could be the granny's face there. But I'm not too sure. I don't know. That. That's definitely a guest. But that one looks like the janitor's face. So the janitor is one of these mannequins. And that's why when we see that his hand, like when his arms get chopped off, he still has some life in them. But the janitor is made here, it would appear. Or at least that's what I would I would guess the janitor's made here. Okay, we can't see him because, you know, or else he'll actually see us. Oh, look at you, little precious. Aren't you just gorgeous? Yeah, I think I think with this, um, it's it takes a little bit too long. Oh God, six! Don't nudge us! What you doing? She wants me to die. Okay, so we have to wait here a little bit. It also kind of sounds like the doctor's crying, like he's sobbing. Like it doesn't matter what he does, he can't, he can't bring these people back to, you know. Oh God. Oh dear, I don't know whether he can see me or not. Uh, like, it doesn't matter what he does, he can't bring them back to normal. He can't bring them back to life, in a way. Okay, let's get going. Let's get moving. While he gets another head out. Because if we get spotted here... Six, man! What are you doing? <laughs> Do you think he'll see us? I don't think he'll see us here. I don't think he will. Because if we get spotted, and we get into here... He'll, um, he'll just, he'll just pick up the bed and <laughs> just kill us. <laughs> there he comes. I think, not that we can really see it, but he's right above us. We're gonna have to wait for him to move on over there before we can actually move. It also feels like, you know, we're dragging Six into this. Even though she was the one who also came on the door, who pushed it. But at the same time, I don't think it was Six's goal to come this way. It's Mono who's like the, the driving... Uh, factor here. Yeah, okay, we can definitely go around. We could probably walk, but, you know, I don't like to risk things. Here we go. Da, 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 da. Oh god, this is gonna be tough now, isn't it? Okay, so we're gonna have to wait till he goes over to- You always nudge me! <laughs> I never noticed this! But in first person, you always bump into me! You have to be like right close to me. Oh, he's over there. Oh, we oh we definitely could have moved down. There he is. Hello, precious. How on earth he sticks to the ceiling? You're nudging me again, aren't you? <laughs> I think we're good. I think we're good. I think we're good here too. Yeah, we're good. We're good. We're good. Yeah, I think he's above us. <laughs> yeah, he's definitely above us. Okay, we just gotta wait a little bit. Right, there he is. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. Woo! And we're out of there! Okay, he's over that way. He's over that way. Okay, go, go, go. We're good. However, when this opens, I think we have to hide under the thingy here. Yeah, we'll hide here. We'll hide here. Hide here. He shouldn't be able to see us. He's gonna come running. I'm just gonna get more under. Because <laughs> normally what I do is I end up going through. But I think what you're supposed to do is stay here. Because I don't think the game's supposed to think, oh, you just run through and then he'll get you. Is he gone? Yeah, he's gone. Awesome. Sweet. Look, more notes. Little notes. Uh, oh, hey, look at this. That looks to be the TV. It's almost like he's studying what the TV does. All right, calm down. Jesus. She's on her way, like. <laughs> Doesn't care about me. Come on. Yeah. There we go. Yes. Didn't wait for me, did you? They'll bugger you. <laughs> Little minx. 
Ah, this is the bit. This is the bit. This is the bit where he comes through. <laughs> Look at him go. Fast walk. Fast crouch. Yeah, I think that that room there isn't too bad. But then here is where it kind of slows down a bit. Like, because now uh, it's nice you get a little bit of a respite. Look at that. It's showing us that we can go down there. You get a little bit of respite, but still, it's yeah. This is where I think it slows down a little bit. To go over here, you got to pull out the box. I mean, even when you know what you're doing, it still it still takes like a little while. You're gonna push me in. Oh, I didn't realize there was guts in here. Oh, I never saw it like that. That's right. I always forget about this. I always end up going over there and doing it that way. But no, then you jump on Jeff. You realize you haven't pulled out this bit. You fool. I know, guys. I know. I hear your comments. I'll take them on board. There we go. But look at this. These people here have their feet. Because all the mannequins that we've seen so far don't have feet. But these look like full-on bodies. Like you've got the head. Or at least, yeah, yeah. Like you've got the head and then you've got the, the torso. Maybe they don't have heads. Huh. Or arms. But they definitely have feet. It's the first time we've ever seen feet. Because all of the mannequins, I don't think they have feet. They only have... Um, they only have hands. Sorry, if they have anything, they have hands. Oh, yeah. Jump up, James. Come on. Because they've only got... Yeah, it's only torso, sorry. Oh, my God, James. Say what you mean. <laughs> you think playing games and talking is easy. It's not. Da -da -da. Da -da -da -da. And I've, I think I've already gra grabbed the, uh, the glitch child in here. So the time is five past five? I think. That's what it says. 5.05. Here we go. Unlocking the door. <gasps> More bookshelves. Yeah, it's interesting. Like, this room really doesn't seem to serve much purpose. Apart from just like, yeah, you just climb on and that's it. Which is really weird. Usually most rooms serve a purpose and this one's just there. Like, why couldn't we have just like gone through a pipe to start with? <laughs> All right, I suppose. It's just, it, it, I guess it's all about pacing, right? It's all about getting ready for this bit. This next bit here. Right. Okay. So I'm going to hide under here. And he's going to go over here. Six, you're pushing me out again. <laughs> he's going to back towards me. <laughs> he's going to push him out. Hopefully he doesn't see. Okay, I think he goes over to... He does, definitely pulls out a dude. Yeah, he pulls out him. And he puts him on the thing. Uh, I think we probably could... We probably had enough time to get over to that table, actually. I don't like it. I, I, I feel like I've done it in the past. Where I've tried to, to speed run uh, this a little bit too quick. Um, <laughs> and he always catches me. So I'm, I'm, I'm always cautious now. When it comes to the teacher... I don't feel like it's too bad. I feel like, you know, there's certain bits where you know you'll get caught. But with with the doctor, man, I don't know what it is. <gasps> Dude, do we get to see? Oh my god, we get to see. I think we get to see who this person is. Oh man, imagine if it was the janitor. Imagine if his name badge said Roger. Oh. <gasps> Right, okay, let's have a look. So he's got he's got arms there. But he does have a head. He actually does have a head. It's possible it could be Roger. It's a, it's a, maybe it's not too much of a stretch when you think about it. Oh, okay. I was going to say is that a name badge to his right? But I think that's normally what the um what the patients have. Otherwise, I would be like, "I've just blown the case wide open." <laughs> Here we come. Here we go. Go on then. Start fixing him. I think we're good. I think we're good. I'd love to know what he's doing. I don't think he's doing anything in particular. He's just like trying to revive him. Yeah, I think he's just trying to revive him. Yeah, the Doctor's one of those monsters that's one of the few that isn't really bad because... All he's doing is um, is trying to help these these things. That's all he's doing. And yet, what do we, how do we repay him? We kill him. Although we don't have to, actually. 
I'd assume that he might actually get out if we don't. Uh, oh, sorry about that. Uh, up, up shot there. <laughs> up we go. To the fuse. Don't know why the flick you've got one in here. What the frick? Alright, Six. Go on. And this is where I'll probably die. I never do this first time. I don't know what it is about it. I'd love to just try and run from him. C shall we just like... <laughs> oh, God! Oh, I'm dead. I'm so dead. I'm so dead. He's just going to knock these over onto me, isn't he? Yeah. <laughs> I was so slow. I was so slow. All right, here we go. Here we go. Six, I'm going to keep up with you because you survive. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. She feels so much quicker than me. Oh, God. He's right there. Oh, God, he got me. <laughs> Why do I feel so slow? There we go. Sod this. Sod this. We're going. We're doing a regular run. We're doing a regular run. Because apparently I can't seem to do it. Whoa. Oh, that's perfect. That's great. If I feel like I get to a bit and we can just keep running. I think we're good. There we go. There we go. There we go. There we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. I can do this bit. I can do this bit. This is easy. This is scripted. I can do this bit. <laughs> yeah, I'm going. I'm a going. I'm a going. Whoa. Oh, God. Oh. <laughs> that was kind of terrifying. <laughs> it just sort of glitched there. <laughs> okay, okay. We got this. We got this. Come on. Yeah. Yeah. Woohoo. We did it, six. Look at him. We closed him. Oh, look, he does. He falls down there. Bless him. We can't go in anymore. Oh, and then he vanishes. <gasps> Come on, Six. Let's go. Let's go. Your weird black eyes. Good God. Whoo. Oh, do you need... Yeah, I need... I think I need you, yeah. Gonna help me. Whoop. <laughs> look at my toes. And that's it. There we go. We did the uh, the doctor. Um, it's a bit of a shame that we couldn't uh, sort of do it all in first person, especially when it came to the um, the what you call it, the uh, the mannequins. But uh, with the way the um, the mod is at the moment, there's just no way. There's literally no way that I'd be able to do that. <laughs> running away from the doctor, running away. Woohoo! Look at us. We did it. And there's the waiting room. What if I just picked up a jar and threw it on him? Well, it smashes and apparently it, it makes a noise, but it doesn't smash. Oh, this is so cool. It's so atmospheric. I love it. We don't have a torch anymore, do we? Oh, no, we do. Oh, we lose it later then. Okay. Oh, ooh. I'm kind of curious as to... Because there's a gutter here. Isn't there? I think there's a gutter here. Yeah, yeah, there is. This is where one of the children are. Or where he's hidden down here. Yeah. <laughs> we'll not go down there because it'll take a long time. You got post. You still got... Like, the thing is with this city, you still got post. Post is still delivered. You got lots of parcels and everything. So, were the TVs delivered to this place in parcels? And then everyone opened them and like, oh, cool, TVs. And then before they realized it, before they knew it, that was their damnation. Um, you got the more, again, I think on the right, TVs. And then, I don't know what that is up there. Oh, it looked like teeth. Hold on. Those look different. Maybe that's the doctor's um, flyer, like advertising his services. That'd be weird. Unless he's part of it. And all these all these monsters are part of taking over regular society, which is like this. Oh god! They fall! 
I want to see this guy fall. Where is he? Whoa! Yep. And they just end up killing themselves. So is it possible that the mannequins are all people that have had their faces sucked and then they die? And then the doctor kind of goes out and, and grabs them? Interesting, interesting. And he sort of tries to fix them. Oh, look, he's already at the TV over there. Oh. This will be interesting to see if I can actually get to him. Like, does he actually vanish when he goes into this room? Yeah, he does. I always tried to beat him to it and to see if I, I could get him. So we got a regular kid there. We've got the bullies and then we got the teacher. Uh, another regular kid there. And then... No. Is that Mono? Sat on a chair. It's a, it's a kid sat on a chair. Are you going to kick the dude six? Are you going to kick him? Give him a kick. Or have you already kicked him while I was there? I think you've probably already kicked him, haven't you? <laughs> all right then, all right. Let's climb up him. We've got to go out here. Oh, yes! And then the ladies, um, or at least uh, a, a room of somebody who knew who the lady was. Is, is here as well as an easter egg. Whether it was actually her room in the Pale City at one point? Doesn't make too much sense. And then you've got the, the residents of... Well, they're not really residents, are they? What would you call them? They're just viewers, right? I think residents of the Pale City, I suppose. Are you okay with me coming up to you? Oh, no, you're not! Oh, God, okay! <laughs> right, okay, so they can kill you. I I just thought these were completely docile. What we got here? What we got here? We've got a picture of feet and a picture of... I don't even know what that is. Just with first person, I just want to be able to see what all these things could mean. Come on, six. Because you don't really get a good look at them. That's right, the guy in the toilet. Could he kill you? I don't think he could. Oh. Oh, yeah, they're going to be some toilet. <laughs> With the TV right there. But you see the power. The power is there. That's cool. Nice little touch. All right. Oh, here we go. This, is, this was one of the puzzles that stumped me for the longest time. I was like, I don't understand how to do this. Am I stupid? <laughs> Woo, God. Bye-bye, six. <laughs> Up we go. Nothing in here right now. No, nothing, nothing in this one. Because at the uh, Huntsman's house, this is where we saw, like, one of the posters for the, um... Did I do it? Oh, I did. Nice. Uh, we saw one of the posters for the moor in here. Which is interesting. Okay. Let me get the key. Ooh. I mean, it looked like that looks awesome. And you see that. <laughs> uh, we got another picture of a gnome scribble. That. Ooh, let's have a look at these pictures. We'll get the key first. There it is. The precious. Right. What do we have? A picture of a toilet. Beautiful. A picture of... What is that? Can't quite make out what the heck that is. You guys know what that is? Let me leave, put it in the comments. Let me know. What the hell is that? <laughs> da, da, da. Da, 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 da. Your freedom, Six. You're free. Yes. Okay, so now we need to... Huh, and then jump off. And get out. There we go. I wonder if I stayed on it while it went down. And if Six would... Would end up uh, bringing it back up by herself. Well, she couldn't. Because she needs me to do it. Okay, here it comes. I'll pick up that. There we go. We need to take the lock with us. Whee! It took me so long to work that out. <laughs> so long. Too long. Oh, here we go. We're going to see the outside in the signal tower. Woo! There it is. Is it a building? Oh. Oh. 
Oh, I just had a thought. No, it couldn't. No, that wouldn't make sense. Okay, I'll, I'll, show you, I'll show you what I'm thinking. So, I've always wondered why... Yeah, and I think everyone's wondered why on earth is... I've already got the secret as well. The signal tower taking the faces, taking the eyes and stuff. And in some cases, taking the whole body. Um, and obviously, to, to make its nightmare real or to, you know, manifest it, it needs a lot of, you know, stuff. And that is what it takes. It takes the eyes from people. It takes the, the mind. It takes... Um, it takes the bodies in order to form, you know, the manifestations that we see inside the signal tower. But what if... Oh, no, other way. No, 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 other way. What if it's using all of the body stuff, all the body pieces, um, to make the signal tower talk? So it can broadcast its, its signal further and further and further. Hmm... Okay, six. Oh, we're coming. Thank you. So nice. Aren't you? Oh, look. It's like an... What is that? It's like a billboard that's an eye. It's almost like we're in a, the in, in a final stage of this city being consumed. So... It's, it's like we see little bits of propaganda that appear. TVs get delivered... And then before the citizens realize it, the signal tower is erected and their, you know, their, their, their lives are changed forever. Um, and they all become part of the signal tower. Hmm. Maybe that could be part of it as well. Again, all of these are just thoughts off the cuff. So, uh, yeah, they're not 100% uh, <laughs> thought can ought to be taken seriously. Come on, Six. Come on. You got this. You got this. In we go. Well, we need to lose Six first in order to see the ladies' room, don't we? And I think this is where it happens. This is where we see a building that's about to fall down and collapse, isn't it? I think this is where we see it. Early up. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Six, need you. I need you. Even she realizes it is this hole coming down. And then this is like, whoa, yeah, <laughs> roly poly. This is where um, I think Six and Mono, like their friendship's like confirmed officially now. Six, no, no, Six. There you go. Did I die or did I just trigger the cutscene? I think I triggered the cutscene. Good, good. Glad to hear it. There she is. This is where she asks for help and we actually give it to her. There we go. There we go. Oh my god, that took a while. <laughs> and this is it. She looks at him. I think she's also contemplating, like, do I really want to help him? I think I do. I think that's what she's thinking right there. Unfortunately. Oh no. This is the room, I think. I think this is it. This is the hallway. Yep. Yep. There it is. Oh, it had to happen. Had to happen. The eyes drawn here. The thin man drawn multiple times. What's scribbled out over here? What's this? It would be interesting to see what was drawn initially. What about a toy train? Do you want to pick up a toy train? Yes? No? Okay. She's 100% focused on me now. Oh, look. Letters. Lots of letters. And an eye. I mean, I mean I'm not surprised. There's always eyes. <sighs> Obviously, these letters have been coming while the residents or whatever haven't been in. Oh, God. Here it is. Here it is. This isn't the same room that we see Six come out of, is it? Is it? Look at that. No! No! Don't look at me! I think it might be. I have to do the two chairs. Hmm. And there is a carpet that she falls on. I wonder if this is where she comes out of, because this is where she's dragged in. Alrighty. It'd be interesting to see what this, this final hallway looks like. Oh, you know what it is! I think that hallway we see floating above um, 
floating above the hallway we go to is that hallway there. I think that one is what we see in the signal tower. Yeah, that's why it's so, like, windy and stuff. This is it. This is the one. Oh, no. Oh. The call. The call that calls to himself because he can pick up on frequencies and he's calling to himself. Oh, well, there he is. released. We've opened the signal tower. We've opened a way for him to get out. Oh, God. Oh, no! This is where she, like, reaches to help me. And then she realizes what's coming as he comes down the hallway and she's like, nope, we gotta go! We gotta go, come on! And yet I can't help myself. I'm still drawn to it. I'm sorry, Six. You're still, you're still holding up with me. And there it is. She's already gone. She's already gone at this point. I think I need to go too. Uh, uh. Six, it's okay. You hate to see it. You hate to see it. And this is the thin man getting his revenge on Six for what she did to him in the past. And all he does is make the same thing happen again. By splitting her in two. Look, you see that? It's not just a shadow of where she was, it gets up, it looks up. And that there is what begins the hunger. Although because she's trapped in the, in the dimension that is the TVs in the signal tower, you don't see it. I'm a coming! Woo! Oh. Well, I'm just left, am I? There we go. That's better. <laughs> so, because it's a cinematic. <laughs> well, guys. Okay, we're going to have to leave it there. And in the next of the next episode, we'll finish it. We'll do the hanging... Oh, the, I was going to say, I can see the picture of the hanging man. We'll do the thin man. And I wonder what the secret ending looks like in first person. Like, are we six? Because we'll get the secret ending because we have got all of the of all of the uh, static children so that'll be interesting but anyway guys if you enjoyed the video leave a like and until next time i'll see you cuties later oh bye bye <laughs>